All right, here's the Yesu uh, FT-102 again. And after working with the uh, adjustment for the plate capacitor to make sure it opens when I increase the value here, it doesn't close, at least when it's on the scale here, then I want to try and do a tuning procedure on this thing. So I'm using a Drake uh, MN2700 tuner here. And uh, I don't really have a good 80 meter antenna, but I'm going to start on 80 meters here and just see if I can tune this thing on each band. So we'll first do an SWR decrease on this thing, and then we'll try and tune it. So that's what we'll do. So to get this thing going, take your drive down, go to your band, pre-select in the middle, um, be in tune mode, heater on, power on, hit mox, moxie, and start working. So now we'll increase the drive a little bit. You can peak the pre-select. You can see now when I wiggle the pre-select, I'm getting a little bit of a current boost on this thing. And let's set the ground rules. 10 seconds max on the plate current, 15 seconds resting, or eventually the 6146s get ruined and then the uh, quiescent current on this thing will always rise and you'll blow your 5 amp fuse and if you replace the 5 amp fuse from the B+, then the uh, tubes eventually um, keep going bad and it ends up catching the transformer on fire. At least that's what Mal says, who's the expert on these radios. Okay, so let's keep going. You want to try and get a, uh, a little increase on the uh, wattmeter here, so hit that. Okay, I'm already seeing some lots going on here, so... I'm just gonna go to set mode here and this is maxed and you want to get some you want to just increase this a little bit well first of all you don't want this thing running hard so let's try and max this for power so my 80 meters is maxing over there which is not so fun um, a little more drive. All right, so I'm at pretty much at full scale. I'm going to go to read now. And I'm going to take this drive down a bit. I don't want to be pushing this thing. And we'll try and dial in a decrease here of SWR and 80 meters. Not that it really matters that much, but. Okay, that's all I'm going to do here. 10 second rule. Okay, and we'll go to power read 200 watt scale right there. And 200 watt scale, 100 watts is there. Hundred watts is there. On the middle scale, 200 watts is there. That's what we're gonna be doing. All right, so hit the same again on 80 meters. And I'm just gonna peak this guy here. Take that a bit for some power. And then we, no, this is peaked up. So hit it with drive and see how much we get. Hit it with some drive. Power's going up, power's going up, current's going up, wow. Okay, that's a lot. Let it rest a minute. That was about 100 watts or so. Let's do that quickly again, let it rest. 15 seconds and we'll try and dip this thing. Get some power out of it. Go for power. Okay, that's it. Okay, my load's all the way down. I can give it a little dab of load here and see what it does. That didn't do a whole lot of good. Whoa, that did. All right, I'm gonna let it rest for a second. Hit the plate not really improving it. So it's cooking about 120 watts right there. I could probably get 200 watts out of this thing if I, if I push it. That's, that's a little more dry. Let's give it a push. That's about 150 watts. You want to keep the plate current in this thing at 300 mils or less, the book says. So that's pushing it hard. 
Anyway, it, it, it could probably do 200 watts on 80 if I really mucked with it, but I'm not going to bother. I could, it, it seems most important to muck with the loading, really, if you're running some power out of it. So let's see if I can take loading down. And now give it some more load. No. Nope. More drive. No. Nope. Okay, I'm not going to push it. Let's go to 40 meters. There's 40. No one talking on there. Take this to 40. Set. And that's it. Take drive down. We're going to peak the pre-select now. It was drive, take the pre-selector, nothing. Okay, there's some, wow, there's some power, there's, there's some power there. Take this down, let it rest. Okay, now we're gonna go read, try and zero out the, zero out the uh, SWR. Let your finals rest a bit, 15 seconds or more. Let's do a quick, okay, let's get some power. SWR down, that's really good there. Just knock it off. 200 watt scale. Let's try and get some power out on 40 meters here. So 40 was giving me trouble and I went in there and realigned the switch wafers so maybe now it's good. Um, let's put it right at seven here and see if that works there. I doubt it will, but let's see what happens. Okay, let's go for max plate. No, that's pretty accurate. So I'm getting Max power around there. Let's do this one. Oh, that's looking reasonable. So I'm only getting uh, 20 watts out, 10 watts. 40 meters and this thing likes drive. So I'm gonna give it some drive here. And some more drive here. Give it some more loading and some drive. Okay, that then takes up to uh, 100 watts right away. And a little more load here. Too much, back it off. Peak the plate. That's peaked. A little more drive, maybe. Let's see. There's 110 watts. Okay. I don't like hitting this thing so hard. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. So I'm way over plate current here. I'm probably at like. Uh, Hitting this thing at 400 mils, which is too high. But at 400 mils, I'm getting some power out, so. Let the finals rest. Okay, 400 mil play current. 450, actually. 150 watts or so. Let's try it again, take a drive down. Peak this guy, a little more load. No, no, it's not gonna go. It, it, I could probably get 200 watts on 40, but I'm not gonna torture the finals to do it. So I'm not gonna bother. That's what linears are for. All right, so let's go to 10 here. And maybe for that, 10, 14, 10, seven. I guess I'll stay on 40 meters for 10. Let's go to set and Take drive down, go to mox here, a little bit of drive. Whoa, this thing is like ready to go. All right, let's go to read here. Get some SWR out if we can without breaking the radio. No, okay. Mm. I'm gonna ruin the transmitter. Okay, so that's giving me hell. You can always tell by the sound what's good or not. How about this band?
try that. Run 10 megahertz. Put on read. There's a set. going down a bit. Oh, it's not great, but it's down. Okay, so at any rate, we'll take that for now. 200 watt scale. Fire it up. Let's treat and pick it. So it's not really bang its meter, but for sure. All right, well anyway, it's it's banging 150 at about 350 mils, so that's pretty good. Yeah, it's banging some power out. 160 watts, that's fine. All right, let's go to uh, 20 meters. I don't hear anybody on here. Okay, 20 meters, uh, 20 meters, 20 meters, run 20. Let's go to set, take drive down, and let's hit it. Drive up, peak this guy here, we're peaked. Let's get some power out of this thing here, we're on set. Whoa, that's a lot of plate current on this thing coming out. Let's get this thing peaked. Wow, there we go. Holy crap. Okay. Let it rest. Fifteen seconds if you can. Okay, I'm in set mode here. A little more drive. Whoa. Okay, that's close enough. Go to read. Let's put these back where they were. Set mode. Okay, read. Let's get this dialed down. There, that's really good. All right, that's fine. Now we'll do some power measurements. Mode 20. I think that's about where it is. Let's do some. Dialing around here. All right, so drive, maximize the power here, maximize the pre select. Okay, we're all good. A little more drive. There's 80 watts. Let's do some load on this thing. Whoa, 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 too much load. Okay, this, whoa, we're pinning the meter here. Pinning the meter. Too much load. Too much current. Too much drive. Still too much drive. Okay, drive's backed off. Let's see if we can improve this thing a bit. There's a peak there, which is weird. Okay, there's a peak there too. Okay, that's about right. That's that's about um that's on the money. More load. Okay, a little more drive. Peak it, a little more load. Nope. So it looks like it's ready to go. Gonna give it some more drive here and see what happens. Eighty watts on twenty. And our plate current's way out way out of the ballpark here. Gonna load it some more. to load is your friend on this thing. Plate current super high. It's 
super high plate current. Okay. So I can get 100 watts easy on 20. Can I get 150? A little more load. Yep. Well, this thing, you just bump the load incrementally. Just like that. That's all you need to do. And then peek your plate. There's 150 about. Maybe 140 on 20, and that's all we're going to do. There's 15 meters coming up here. Actually, no. 18 megahertz. Going to go direct on that band. Because I know my antenna works good there. All right. Let's do it up. Let's take a drive down, turn it on, some drive, peak the pre-selector, there we go, got some power coming out already. Plate is smack on for that one. Increase the drive a little bit. All right, so 15 seconds off rule. 80 watts on that one maybe. Take the load down a bit. A little more load. A little more drive. Not quite 100 watts yet. Ooh, that's, it wants load. It definitely wants load. Okay, so I'm not gonna burn this thing up. 100 watts, maybe you can get more, but I'm not going to try it. 15 meters. Drive down, there's the pre-selector. 15 meters. Um, 15 meters set. There we go. Fired up. Get some drive on this thing. Whoa, it's got, already got some power coming out. Read. Null out the SWR. Null it out. It's out. All right. Power 200 watts. Let's try it now. There's 21. That little scale is not too accurate. Loading one more drive. 50 watts. A little more drive. 80 watts. A little less load. A little more load. So, I'm not getting a whole lot out of 15, but 60 watts. There we go. There's 100 watts. Doesn't like a lot of loading. A little bit more. Yeah, this radio is funny about the load. You really, it's really fussy, fussy, fussy. 100 watts. Just kind of move the load like a hairline. 110 watts. 110 watts, 110 watts, 120 watts. Kick and drive up a little bit. 120 watts. On 15, that's all I'm gonna bother with it. Not gonna try and get more out of it. Okay, 24 and a half band. No one talking. Um, I'll go direct on that one because I know it's got good SWR. So let's try that. Pre-selector, drive down, hit it, up the drive, peak the pre-select. It's good. We got some stuff coming out already. There we go. 
more drive, more drive, too much plate current. Is my plate current working right? When I dip, I should have max power. The finals do need neutralized a bit. Okay, the finals rest. Yeah, people burn these radios by uh, tuning them up too much and then the finals will uh, blow fuses. They take too much current and then they put a bigger fuse in and then eventually a transformer burns up right here. So don't want to do that. Okay, tune it. Ooh, a little more load. This one's less load. Okay. So I'm thinking about 40 watts only on that part of the band there. Tune the pre-select. Oh, pre-select was off. So, 60 watts. Not too much play current going on. Can I tune for a dip? Nope. More load. Sometimes load will take the play current away. Yeah, so there it goes. It's taking it, taking it away. A little more load. Nope. Okay, so I don't want to fry the radio. I'm not getting much in that band. 70 watts, maybe. Let's try 10. There's 10. It's making a weird noise, huh? Okay, 10, 10. Pre-selector, 10. Let's try 10. I'm on direct for 10. Probably go to set. Move this thing to 10 meters. Okay, let's give it a try. Some drive. Well, it's got power coming out. Let's try and peak it. I got a pretty good dip on here. I'm not uh, doing too well. The final's neutralized in this thing. Okay, let's cut it off. Wait 15 seconds and then we'll try for the uh, dip on SWR. There we go. Yeah, it's blowing out some pretty hot air back there. All right, 15, 20 seconds wait. Let him pull down. It's not too much current going out. Let's do a dip on this thing. 10 meter dip. Okay, we're dipping away here. Wind's blowing outside, the antenna's moving, that's that's fine. All right, let's now try and power this thing up. So wait a little while. 200 watt scale on 10 meters. Now we're gonna go for some power. There we go, some more drive. The loading on 10, I'm not sure about. Oh, it's taking some load. It's taking, wow, it's taking some load. There's 60 watts. So I'm really cooking the finals. I got about 60 watts coming out. Maybe I won't get any more. Let it rest. Okay, let's try this again. Be able to take the loading down a bit. Well, that's about 60 watts. Not too impressive, but can I better that number? Increase the load a little bit. Still 60. No, oh, there's 70. A little more load. Okay, so. Probably only 70 watts. A um, little less load now. Let's peak it. 70 watts. Now, what if I drive it harder? A little more drive. Wow, okay, there's 100 watts and more drive. 100 watts on 10. A little more drive. What are you going to give me here? 
That's all she's gonna do, that's fine. Let's tweak it. Okay. That's probably about 120 on 10, 120 watts or something. That's all I'm gonna do. Okay, I hope you enjoyed my little demo of how to tune up a, uh, a Yaesu FT102. 360 and 46 is in the final, it's a little radio, 19. I think this thing's like an 88, 87 bit inch, or 84, it's old. But it's a workhorse and it's pretty cool. Let's go back to 40 meters here. LSB. Take this back to direct. Okay, receive. Let's see what's going on. Some very weak AM stations. Let's try any meters. What time is it? Alexa, what time is it? It's 7 15 p.m. Okay, so there could be the AMI net on. There's 37, let's go to um, 3885, 885, there are 3870. 3870. Let's see if these guys are on here. Nope. Nobody there. A lot of static. There they are. They are here. Includes my demo of the FT-102 transmitter tuning and a little bit of receiving. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day.